Are you... Are you crying, my child? I... It's fine, Jack. Now, you didn't happen to see my notebook, did you, darling? Uh, my memory's a bit fuzzy. So much for aging gracefully. Where is that? Listen, Jack. You should probably get some rest. Forget the notebook. Oh, no, no. no. I've got so much work, my dear. It's I, okay, I, Jack. No, I, I can't just... What? Let it go. Um, it's not important. You... You are crying. Why is it so cold in here? Jack, where is that shh, 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 shh. Huh? It's okay, hey. Jack. Huh? It's okay. My sweet little Marianne. <laughs> what would I ever do without you? <laughs> Jack. Huh? Don't worry about it. Uh, it's time to get uh, some rest. Oh. I'm worried about the surgery. When I'm at the hospital, are, are you sure you're going to be all right? Yes, Jack. It's going to be fine. Uh, oh, you know, uh, I promised myself once uh, I would never let anything happen to you. Not while I'm around. I'll be fine. I promise. Oh. <laughs> no risky stuff then. Huh? All right? All right, Jack. Now, get some uh, rest. I, I need no. Yes, yes. Be, be good, Marianne. I love you, my child. I've loved you since the moment you walked into my life. Remember that. Most people would give anything to have that opportunity. To say all the things that were left unsaid. But it didn't make things any easier. I could help a thousand souls cross over, but when it came to Jack, it still hurt like hell. I love you too, Daddy. I used to think everyone saw the world the way I did. Divided. Torn between two realities. But... No. I was the only one. Or so I thought. We're closed. There's another funeral home across town. I can give you the number. I... Marianne. Who is this? You don't know me, Marianne. But I know you. Look, if this is a joke... I... You need to listen to me, Marianne. Okay, I I'm hanging up. I know what you are. What? Who is this? My name is Thomas. I need your help. Uh -huh. <laughs> Listen, if that's all you've got, I'm... No, uh... there's more. I can give you the answers you've been looking for your whole life. But I, I need you to trust me. Trust you? I don't even know you. It all starts with a dead girl. What did you say? The Neva Resort. Find me there. Please. The light, it's almost gone. It's not dark yet, but it's getting there. You're the only one who can stop it. You're my only chance. Hello? Hello? Shit.
and off I went, on nothing but a hunch. A call from a complete stranger. But I'd learned to trust my instincts, and there was something about this guy, his voice. I felt like I should know him. Either way, he sure seemed to know me. The Neva Workers Resort. Right off the bat, I could feel there was something off about that place. Anyone home? I guess not. Hello? Thomas? The front gate was locked up tight. I needed to find another way in. <laughs> 